Okay, hello and welcome to another speaking practice by IELTS Journey. And this is class IELTS 40, and they are doing their regular speaking practice today. Today is the 15th of January 2023. We are a week away, one week away from the Lunar New Year, or in Vietnam we call it Tet. And probably my students are busy cleaning and are very tired cleaning their house, you know, their houses. All right. Let's uh, take a break and learn and do some learning. Okay, we did bargain before. Let's do decoration. Did we do this one before? Decoration? Yes. Yeah. We did this one already. Okay, number nine. Already done. Decor. Okay, because I, I remember we did this one before. Okay, how about TV program? We didn't do that, right? Not yet. I don't think we have done TV programs. Yep, so, okay. <clears throat> okay, let me just do this, save some space. Okay, let's talk about TV programs today now. So, Ms. Yu, what kind of TV programs do you like? We have many types of TV programs, you know. Like we have comedy, packet, we have dramas, uh, we have documentary, documentary, bit by little, we have as uh, TV series, những chương trình TV dài tập. So there are many series, there are many episodes, there are many episodes, there are many episodes in a TV series. Like for example, a eight years old, the uh, eight years old bride from India, cô dâu tám tuổi từ Ấn Độ. Like it can be up to two thousand episodes. I can't believe it. <laughs> a two thousand episode, hai ngàn tập, dài dài trong mười năm. It's like what? Anyway, so we have other kind of TV programs. Like for example, we have uh, news. We have um, what's it called? We have many kind of movies, right? Action, action movies, thrillers, film We have uh, sitcom. You know what sitcom is, right? Yes. Situational, situational comedy or sitcom. <coughs> we have um, reality, reality TV shows. Um, we have many other kind of programs, you know. So, Miss Yu, what kind of TV programs do you like and why? <coughs> well, I think I'm an easygoing person, so I'm kind of uh, watch anything interesting 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 for me however i um, my my younger brother and i usually watch document together um well um learning about our earth our the the forest in the world is very um uh, amazing it's amazing it's, a, it's an amazing experience don't you think it's amazing um okay yes how about you For, what kind of TV programs do you like hmm. yes like watching cartoon oh cartoon you can watch in cartoon of course well you still watch cartoon really uh yeah like uh anime yeah exactly anime is different from cartoon you know anime yeah, is like, i think it's uh, different for teenager and then more than that cartoon is more but, like from, but actually you know, i still i still watching cartoon it's fine it's fine but normally cartoons for children but anime is for teenagers and people um, some people more than 18 years old they watch anime as well no problem I think okay, so uh, what do you think about game shows? 
like you see a lot of game shows in Vietnam, right? What do you think about them? Mm. Oh, actually, I don't watch. I don't watch a lot of game show on TV. Mm-hmm. So I, I think I watch a few, a few. Mm-hmm. Mm, but I think it's not interesting like game show in in America. Yes. And then, of course, uh, and, and of course, it's very boring at time because they keep repeating and then singing and things like that, right? Yeah, exactly. It's like, it's like they just keep repeating the same old thing. Yes. I feel like that. Oh my god, look at this one. My cat is biting my equipment. <laughs> That's why something is... Some, I think I feel like sometimes it's malfunction. Ah. <laughs> oh. You see, that's why I need to punish my cats. You need to punish them for their misbehavior. Otherwise, that thing could continue to happen always, you know. We should continue to punish them. So they will know what's the good and what's bad behavior. Oh, I think they know. Anyway, I think they do. So after some time, they do understand. Okay, anyway, Miss Tom, please. So, uh, what kind of TV program do you like? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, uh, to be honest, uh, I rarely watched uh, uh, any kind of TV program because uh, I don't have any cables. <laughs> but, you don't have uh, any what? Cables. Make it gap, Ah, you don't have any cables, I see. And but in the past, I really I was really fond of uh sitcom uh programs on TV. Uh, you like to watch them, really? Yes. Um. And but now I I uh rarely watch it, and but because it's so boring and didn't and don't uh, captivate me. So that's the reason why I... It's getting more lame. It's getting more lame. Why? Yeah. 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 And um, it's, it's getting less and less attractive to me, I think. You can just say that. Yes. Maybe maybe it's just not um, attractive. It's the content is not as alluring. You know the word alluring, right? It means attractive. The content is not alluring or attractive as um, when it first comes out, right? When it first comes out, thì bắt đầu cái chương trình đó thì nghe có vẻ hấp dẫn lắm nhưng mà càng về sau chất lượng càng dở như you know, in Vietnam, a lot of things at first it seems very good, but after sometimes the quality just <sighs> go down. So, Miss Yeo, do you often watch programs on the TV or on your cell phone? I mean, smartphone. I prefer <laughs> watching program on the TV with bigger screen screen. Mm-hmm. Yes. <clears throat> yeah, and the sounds and the the experience it brings. It brings to it brings so much better. You mean the sound and experience bring it so much better? I see. <clears throat> okay, good. So, um, maybe on plasma TV with good uh, speaker system, it would it would sound much better. You think so? Than on a smartphone? Yes. Of course. But you know, a smartphone is much more convenient. That's why people still use smartphone. Yeah, sure. All right. So, Miss Yeo, what do you think about reality TV shows? Do you think they're good? Reality TV shows like you uh, do not prepare anything. You just go there and then you you uh, just uh, videotape. But that is the spirit of reality TV show. But to be honest with you, everything is staged. Cái gì mà chẳng bị gọi là 
sắp đặt everything is staged sắp đặt trước in term everything is, everything is staged or fake it's not real even though it's called reality tv show but actually a lot of them is not real you know so in what do you think about reality TV TV shows? yeah i don't uh well if we talk about the uh, Vietnamese real reality TV shows, uh -huh. I'm not into it. I think I barely watch t uh, uh -huh. Vietnamese shows. But um, in terms of TV sh uh, real reality TV show in America, I really uh, into it because there are a show about uh, which about um a man who live in a a young girl alone he have to repair everything himself that so, sounds very fake that sounds really I, fake though maybe it's fake but the experience and the reaction and other things seem good to me mm -hmm. and and oh, um when i about uh, when i <clears throat> when i watch it um i can, i can see the những khung cảnh tuyệt vời i can see beautiful sceneries i can see beautiful <cười> sceneries uh beautiful scenery scenery beautiful scenery những cảnh trí tuyệt đẹp yeah and <clears throat> and learn about new um không phải điều, những bộ tộc ấy. tribes tribes, tribes. We, have all, we have also um tv programs to discover nature you know like national geography for example geography national geography is like a program to okay. um discover nature and also discover the tribes in the forest, something like that. You know? <clears throat> yeah, so I think I kind of like reality TV shows. Mm. Okay, so Mr. Fun, what do you think about uh, documentaries? Phim tài liệu, like documentaries um, about issues such as um, history, such as social uh, issues, những vấn đề xã hội. Something like LGBT uh, development in Vietnam, for example. What do you think about documentary? This one. Oh, it's hard for me to. Uh, it's hard for me to say, but uh, I think uh, in terms of documentaries, I usually uh into his history uh document historical documentary. Uh, because it brings me a uh, loss of knowledge and it can uh, broaden my knowledge and I can know more uh, from other perspective and you know that uh, in any t TV program in Vietnam uh, we just see uh, uh, we just see only the national uh uh national feed national channel which is uh, we just see national yeah. channels there's no there's no private channels right yes không có những cái kênh uh, riêng uh, kênh tư nhân there's no private channels but it's just national channels and we can we can't know more about anything that uh that is uh, new and is new and interesting so uh in uh to sum it i think uh documentary is the nice way to broaden my knowledge and know more about anything new and anything in the past anything new anything new anything new and no, anything, no, anything new anything new not news new and anything new. Right? anything new and anything in the past, such as any remain or artifact. 
yes. artifacts or remains. Very good. Remains or artifacts. Những gì vật hoặc là những gì còn sót lại. Okay, what do you think, folks? What do you think about dramas on TV? Like we have Chinese drama, we have uh, Hong Kong cha dramas, we have Vietnamese dramas, like Cầm Ngũi or something like that. We have uh, Korean dramas. What do you think about them? Uh, actually, I don't like drama and I don't watch it much. Because mm -hmm. it's like, uh, it's like very, yeah, yo, it's fake, of course. It's very stage. Yeah. It's very stage. Nó rất là được dàn dựng luôn á. It's very stage yeah. and uh, um, not real. The content, the content is not real. Yeah, of and it's not real. <coughs> oh, by the, like the số chi tiết nó rất chi là sạm and some um some details some details some details are um are really fake yes. some details are really fake and many không có hợp lý and uh, unrealistic không thực tế nghe không thực tế they unrealistic and really fake as well so Do you watch? Do you like watching the same kind of program all the time? Em thích coi cùng một loại chương trình lúc nào cũng vậy không? Not really because I but like I like watching cartoon. I watch it all the time, but <coughs> when I feel boring. Like, Wait, when I, I, I feel boring or when I feel bored? Cẩn thận. When I feel bored. Phải dùng đúng tính từ, tính từ bị động mới đúng. When I cảm giác của mình. Bored. Uh, when, when I feel bored. Like, you have to say when I feel bored. Feel bored. Uh -huh. When I feel bored. When I watch uh, cartoon too much, I like to watch uh, action. Action. Okay. Can you name a few? A few like, programs that you like to watch? Action, science fiction, or maybe horror. Like science fiction like uh, Optimus Prime. Uh -huh. uh, horror like Annabelle. Action Cannibal. like... Cannibal Lecter? Yeah, cannibal. Of course, uh, Cannibal Lecter is a cannibal. Um, action... Fast and Furious. Fast and the Furious. I thought Fast and Furious is really old already. Oh, is yeah, I got the phone chin. Oh, it's Fast and Furious 9, I see. Okay, good, good. So, Mr. Hong, uh, do you talk with your friends about a program you watched? Uh, actually, I rarely talked to, uh, to my friends about any programs that I watched. Because uh, we uh, have not the same interests, so we don't have the same interests. Yeah, we don't have a same. We don't have the same interests. So, I think it's so uh, boring when I talk to them any my favorites. But uh, uh, in terms of online friends, I talk a lot because um. We have the same interest, and it's really, uh, it's really, rất là vui. It's really. It's really fun to talk to them. It's really to talk to them. It's really fun and, to talk to them. Cẩn thận, fun với funny khác nhau nha. Yeah. <laughs> you know what's the different, right? Fun and funny. Fun means like it makes you feel good. Hmm, it's fun. But funny means you want to laugh. Muốn phá ra cười, cười nước mát mẻ luôn. Á. But funny also means that you want to say that someone's behavior is not good and it's laughable. Khi mà muốn nói về một cái hành vi con người nào đó buồn cười quá, hành xử buồn cười vậy. It's uh, when someone's behavior is laughable or bad behavior, you can say, you're so funny. 
be careful with this one. Okay, fun or funny? Yes. Okay, let's continue. Một cái là vui, một cái là mắc cười quá. But yeah. But uh, it depends because uh, any program that are uh, not uh suitable and not uh captivate them. So captivating, captivating. It's not captivating, and I think that I just uh watched any program alone and alone alone and uh if i really uh in really into it i would talk to them yes just that okay just that good 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 now miss you please uh what do you think about tv programs in vietnam do you think it should be improved somehow or is it good enough or something is Actually, this is a hard question for it me. It is a hard question, yeah. Yeah, because I'm not a fan of Vietnamese TV programs, but um, my my parents they usually watch them, so I think somehow is uh an entertain uh có tính giải trí là entertain. It's entertaining, mang tính Ent- chất gì đó. Bây giờ tính từ và chủ động. When yeah. you talk about a characteristic of something, you use the verb ing form, active form. It's entertaining. Yeah, my parents, they usually watch them. So somehow I think uh, there's, some bro- there's some programs interesting, sorry, mm-hmm. entertaining and interesting. Mm, but um, in my point of view, um, when I accidental uh, accidental catch some some strings, I don't see um I, I see that it's it's staged and um and fake. Mm-hmm. Very staged but, and very fake. Yeah. <clears throat> but I I do believe they have some some shows that really good lately i watched two day one two days one night and i think i enjoyed okay good the rest i'm not sure okay so uh miss you um do you talk with your friends about a program you watched um program is not a topic between my friend and I, but oh. we are, I have um, I have a college, and she watch um, a colleague, a colleague. 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 I have a colleague. I have a colleague. She also uh watch the same program like me. We usually talk about it. Um. And sometimes we even um, mimic the the voice and tone. The voice and tone uh, of the actors uh, of the, the show. Actor of the show. Of the show. It's very funny. And no, wait, it's very fun or funny? Funny. <laughs> because mimic, uh, mimicking it. Mimicking, uh, mimicking it. Mimicking, mimicking it. <laughs> mimicking the act- actors is very funny yeah. and in the reality situation we also like um are put in in some some similar situation like in the program okay so that's interesting too <laughs> that, that okay. is interesting to talk with with a colleague colleague with colleagues okay very good okay for please do you prefer international tv programs or national ones i think you can tv quốc tế hay là quốc gia nó là cái gì đây say again kiểu là international tv program like for example english program from america for example program from europe for example compared oh, to vietnamese oh. national programs 
think I refer to national TV called Rough Crimes. Uh -huh. uh, because, like, uh, national program is like very boring. Uh, and I usually watch action science TV, uh, action horror and cartoon. Like, mm -hmm. in like action English movie. Okay, so try it again. Try that again. Uh, I prefer international, international okay. TV prefer? programs because programs. Những đầu programs. Programs because is how because because I usually watch cartoon and action movie in English. Mm -hmm. That's why you're speaking. It's not that bad. Yeah. But your writing seems programmatic. That's why you need yeah. to learn more. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, you always said you will, but you never do. Silence, man. Anyway, so, Mr. Wang, please, do you prefer international TV programs or national ones? Uh, I tend to prefer watching international TV programs uh, this is probably because any programs uh, is uh, English. Is in English, yeah, so it helps. Is you. English. So, and I think it's a nice way for me to learn and to practice. study. To learn to, to, practice. to practice English, yeah. To learn and to practice English. Uh, and any TV programs is so uh, captivating. Uh, I really uh, passionate about any animals, any any films about animals, and because I can know about habitat, their habitats and habitats, know... habitats, habitats. I can know about their ha habitats, habitats. I can know more about habitats and yes. you know that some of animals that some we... of animals has some of some, the animals some of the animals some of the animals some of the animals uh we cannot see in real life I cannot see in real life so you mean they became extinct already <clears throat> yes and maybe it's far from me and I can see it yes and international TV program uh, is the good choice for me to know and to watch some of animals. That's some all. of animal or some of the animals. Some of the, of the animals. Because some of animal why? Of the da. Đằng sau yeah. thường là như vậy. I'm sorry. Some of the animals, yeah. Yeah. Đó, cái lỗi này bị dính lúc mà thì là speaking và writing dính hoài luôn á. You got this mistake all the time when people are <laughs> speaking and writing. Eh? Some of the animals. Anyway, let's go on to part two and three now. Các bạn phải chú ý vào chứ không là cứ phạm phải lỗi này hoài đúng không? Cứ sửa đi sửa lại sửa mãi sửa không sửa không được luôn á. Tại vì các bạn không chú ý. Pay attention to your mistakes, otherwise you will not learn anything. Okay, now continue. We let's go to part three, uh, two and three. Let's do this topic. Um, <clears throat> let's try number ten, okay? Maybe okay. No, no, maybe it's something else. Um, try number five then. Let me make this one smaller and easier to see. Yes, and then this one. Okay, let's do number five now. 
describe a part of a city or town that you enjoy spending time in miêu tả một cái phần của thị trấn hay thành phố mà bạn thích uh, dành thời gian ở đó like it can be a place that you enjoy spending time in for example a park a cafe a ca- cafe or a coffee shop or it can be a shop it can be a shopping mall it can be a school it can be a library it can be a church it can be a pagoda it can be anything even public gardens những cái vườn cái vườn của công cộng vườn cây công cộng public gardens it can be anything a part of a city or town you enjoy spending time in you should say where it, what it is what it's like nó nhìn như thế nào nó nằm ở đâu what do you do there các bạn làm gì đó Why do you enjoy spending time there? Cái, tại sao các bạn lại thích dành thời gian ở đó? And then part three of public places. What public places are common in cities in your country? Có những nơi công cộng nào nó thông dụng, nó thông thường thấy được ở những thị trấn hay thành phố ở đất nước của bạn? Like talk about maybe museums, maybe uh, parks, maybe um, stadium. Stadium, trong bằng đọc. Maybe um, museum, maybe public park, <cười> or maybe swimming pool. Could be, no? And then you can say, uh, you can expand it. Like, um, what do you think about those places? Uh, a lot of people attend, or a lot of people go to those places, and why? Do you think your country is keeping those places functional? Do you think your country is keeping those public places functional? Bạn có nghĩ là đất nước bạn đang giữ cái những cái nơi công cộng đó là nó chức năng thực hiện chức năng tốt không? Tức là làm sao? Nó có vận hành cực tốt hay không? Hay là để phí tiền không? It means like, are they wasting money on it without doing anything? Or do you think people can enjoy using them and is it efficient? Có hiệu quả hay không? Try to expand it. <cười> Ráng mở rộng ra. Next one. Do cities need to have more public places than towns? Why, why not? Những thành phố có cần phải có nhiều nơi công cộng hơn là những thị trấn không? Tại sao, tại sao không? Um, think about the size of city and towns and the population as well. Nghĩ về kích cỡ thành phố, thành thị và thị trấn và cái dân số nữa, cái nhu cầu nữa nữa. Like the demand. The demands for places. Ví dụ như nơi thành phố càng lớn thì càng có nhiều, cần, càng cần có nhiều thu khu mua sắm và nơi vui chơi cho trẻ nhỏ và khu vui chơi cho người lớn nữa nha. Like the bigger the town of city is, the more um, recreational facilities những cơ sở vật chất giải trí the more recreational facilities uh, you need to serve the growing to serve the growing population để phục vụ cho cái dân số mà đang ngày ngày gia tăng lên ok think about this one What public places do old people usually go to? Những người già thường thích đi đến những nơi công cộng nào? Of course, beside from the old people's homes, nó gọi là nhà vườn dưới vườn lão á. Ngoài cái vị dưới lão ra thì, of course, they usually go to where? Where do you usually go to? What do you think? <cười> Đương nhiên họ thường thích đi đến những cái pubs, những cái quán rượu cũ, quán rượu. They like to go to pubs. But not bars, okay? Bars are basically above the ground, okay? Cái bar thì nó phải nằm trên mặt đất, còn pubs nằm dưới đất. Pubs are actually underground. Um, do they often go to trường đua ngược ạ? Like, um, what's it called? Racing, uh, racing uh, ground, I think. It's called racing ground, I think. Do they often go to stadium? Thường nó vận động không? Or what else? Do they often go to restaurant, for example? Library? Những cái thư viện, những cái nhà hàng không? My cats. 
Ok And you need to explain why as well Các bạn phải giải thích tại sao họ lại đi thêm mấy nơi đó Nghĩ về những nhu cầu của họ để think about their needs Think about um, những nhu cầu thì họ có nhu cầu gì They have the needs to socialize The need to socialize Người già cực kỳ có nhu cầu xã giao nha mọi người Xã giao, giao tiếp nha They need to talk to people Because most of the time The young people don't want to talk to older people Phần đông người trẻ không thích nói chuyện người già người lớn tuổi đâu So that's why Older people they need to socialize more They need uh, people to talk to They need to places you know Đặc biệt là những người già và lớn tuổi mà lại là mang tính hướng ngoại nữa <cười> Especially extrovert, extroverted uh, old men and women you know? Ok, think about hospital as well Đương nhiên người già sẽ đi đến bệnh viện nhiều hơn rồi Of course, uh, old people they usually go to hospitals much more than young people và đương nhiên là có nhiều người coi cái việc dưỡng lão như là cái nhà của họ đúng không? A lot of people they consider the old people's home as their own home as well. They stay there. Okay. Now, do you think there will be more outdoor public places in the future? Bạn có nghĩ sẽ có những cái nơi mà công cộng ngoài trời nhiều hơn cho tương lai không? Outdoor, okay? Public places. So it can include stadium. It can include many things. Places. Think about this one. Why? Why not? Suy nghĩ các bạn. Cái nơi nào ngoài trời? Tại sao? Nó ảnh hưởng nhu cầu của người dân như thế nào? Think about this one. Okay, let's start to talk about it now. Okay, Miss uh, Miss Hoàng, you first, please. Describe a part of a city or town you enjoy spending time in. Um, going to talk about the a party feel. Um. A paddy pills, yes, uh, that's in the, the border between uh, Vietnam and Cambodia. Uh, uh, it's in An Giang, Chợ Đốc An Giang, and Chợ Đốc An Giang really... province. You need to, yeah, when Chợ you mention a name that is not English, you have to explain. Khi mà nêu một cái đó không phải tiếng Anh, mình phải explain nó là cái gì. Uh, in Chao Doc An Giang, uh, which are regions uh, to the south of Vietnam, for example, mà là những vùng nằm phía nam Việt Nam này. Uh, which uh, which is the province uh, in southern Vietnam, and I really love uh, spending time in this place because uh, như bằng qua thì giống như mình đi ngang á là mình gọi như sao vậy? When I cross the place, when I it was when I pass by that place. Khi mà tôi băng qua cái vùng đó thì sao? When I pass by that place, I <cười> when I pass by that place, uh, I really enjoy it because there's a lot of uh beautiful landscape and there's a lot of mountains. And on top of that, there's a uh, a fast flowing river and the fast the, flowing river. <clears throat> and at this time I just want to get off of my uh car and take a photo mm -hmm. and post it on my uh Facebook. Mm -hmm. uh, and so that's the reason why I love uh a paddy field that's in the border between Vietnam and Cambodia. Yeah. And I really love spending time in this yeah, place. Like, 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 like. There's something yeah. repeating, yeah. Yeah, because... Uh, That's I why mean, I enjoy spending time there. You don't have to repeat what is Patty feel and where it is, you know? Không cần yeah. lại nằm ở đâu đâu, hay là nó là cái gì đâu. Especially... Okay. Uh, Uh, it allows me to uh, recharge my batteries. Uh, my yes. battery. Okay. Look, for, please, your turn. Describe a part of the city or town you enjoy spending time in, please. Mm, I'm going to talk about like um mini foot pitch. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? Mini football pitch. Some of that mini that. Mini what? 
đọc sai tùm lâm mà người ta không hiểu là đúng không? Your pronunciation, they need to not understand what you say. Try again. A, film, a, a mini football court, let's just say that. <cười> yeah. Xong bóng đó nhỉ? A mini football court. A uh, mini football court. 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 A uh, court. Court. A mini football court. Yes, what about it? I... Uh, like I used to go there in Saturday and Sunday. On Saturday. On Saturday. On Saturday. On Saturday and Sunday. On Saturday and Sunday because I usually like have a football have football training and a football match there, and I like spending time there because. Has helped me reduce stress after uh, me reduce stress after after a week learning, and <clears throat> and make me more stronger, like make me more what? healthier, more healthier, make me healthier. I say. Okay. Right, make me healthier. Okay, good. Okay, so Miss uh, Miu, please your turn. To describe a part of a city or town you enjoy spending time in. Well, my city has um, many beautiful places, but um, I enjoy to spending time in Sancha Mountain, which in which is in the northeast of Da Nang City, my city. Um, the way to the top of the mountain is very beautiful and there are some stops on the way you stop can... stop stop are you sure stops stops stop có nhiều cái khoảng để mà dừng lại there are many stops có thằng chữ stop một cái từ stops. không được sử dụng cho IELTS nha cái thứ này thứ kia là không được yes. nha yes careful there are many stops on the way there stops there, there are many stops on the way there where you can see uh, where you can look down and see the whole city oh, um, turn on your microphone always my friend my friends and I usually go there for a short picnic or just enjoy the view um, especially um, the Bình Minh là gì? Quay nào? The dawn. John. Sun dawn. The dawn. Dawn. And sunset is basically my own. Dawn is Bình Minh. Especially dawn, to see the, the dawn. View, the, the view is stunning at in the door. In the door. Dawn. At dawn. At dawn. The view is stunning at dawn. You can see the whole sky turn to turns to orange or red, and the horizontal between. Wait, uh, the horizon, the horizon between. Yan tờ, the, yan tờ. You need to use a now. Uh, the horizon between. The horizon between the sky and the beach. Um. It separate the 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 color the color of the how to describe it the color of the sky and the peach, uh, blend blend together. It separate the color of the sky and the sea actually not the beach. Cái beach là cái bãi biển thôi. Còn cái đó là nó phải tắt biệt giữa biển và bầu trời mới đúng. The beach is only where you can see the sand and people and uh, well, sea, yes. But what yeah. you meant to say is that it separate the color of the sky and the ocean <coughs> or the uh, sea. And besides the um, the air there is the fresh. The air, the air is pressure. The air, the air there is pressure and um, well, that's the best play, place to uh, recharge energy after uh, a week of hard working. A week of hard work. 
A week of hard work. A week of hard work. A week after a week of hard work. After so, a week of hard work. After okay. my that's so that's my favorite place in town in the city. Okay, very good. Now let's go to part three of public places. So, uh, Mr. Please, well, what public places are common in cities in your country? Let's try it. <clears throat> well, I'm not sure that uh, any public places uh, in my countries, but uh, I suppose uh, is any shopping mall and any restaurant. Any what? Shopping malls and any what? Restaurants. Restaurants. Yes, restaurants. Uh, or recreational. Um, uh, recreational center. facilities, right? Yeah. Yes. Um, I think uh, well, uh, after uh, hard hard working days, people uh actually go to it to go to this kind of place to enjoy and to relax. Uh, for instance, I, I usually see any uh, people that uh, pick their children, go to the mall to purchase any items and they take the photos, they post it on Facebook, Instagram, and I think it's a nice way for, be for people in my country to um to relax and to cái gì ta to what uh to như giống như có những cái khoảng khắc uh and to have uh, the moments yeah to have an uh to have there are moments right to have, have people, the... to have there are moments yes yes that's all Okay, good. All right. The full place. So, do cities need to have more public places than towns? What do you think? Why? Why not? Place like public places, exactly. Mm. Uh, well, I think. What do you think? So, like, I'm thinking about this problem. You haven't really talked much about this problem, right? Try yeah. to go around. Try to talk about it. If you don't know how to talk, you need to go around. Try to beat around the bush. Try to explain it. Try to think about it. So, like, I'm not having this problem. You know. And I get it right. I already explained it to you already. Mm. Think about the size of cities, the population, and the needs of the people. Think about age groups. Towns often have uh, more old people because the young people often migrate to the city, right? So what would happen? Think. Think. <clears throat> All right, folk, try it. Brains it. Đừng có tệ như vậy chứ. Try to be better. Now, what public places do old people usually go to? What do you think? Stadium. What public places do old people usually go to, and why? Mm. Excuse me, I gave you time to think about this one. If you do not understand, you do not know, you ask me. Excuse me, are you trying to make me angry or what? We are practicing. Em không nghĩ, em không nghĩ tới vấn đề này. Nếu mà không phải nghĩ thì em thì, 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 thì phải hỏi. Thì phải hỏi để cho thầy gợi ý đấy chứ. You really don't want to study, do you? Really? 
Okay, Miss Yeo, please. Can you answer that question? The city needs to have more public places than towns. Why? Why not? <clears throat> well, I believe that um, city cities need to have more public places because it's obviously city is bigger than town, and the population, young soy, young soy population, yes. the, the population, population in cities yes. is Papa. higher in city is higher. Mm -hmm. So, um, that leads to uh, need to the higher demands of um public public places. Mm -hmm. It needs to lead to higher demand in public places. So, what does Where it lead to? What else does it lead to? Um, in city, in the city, the. Um, uh, speed of light is faster and and more. You mean the light pace, the pace of light. Yeah, space. The space of life, it's faster. Pace. So what would happen? So people will um don't people they have to live in most of them have to live in apartment which don't have. Uh, what which don't don't involve much the nature, so the nature là không đúng cái tự nhiên không có đờ nha không có mm. cái thiên nhiên chiếc thiên nhiên đâu nó chỉ có nature thôi. There's no the before nature. Remember, it doesn't in, it don't involve anything natural at all. Không bao gồm những thứ gì mang tính thiên nhiên hết. It doesn't involve anything. It don't involve anything natural at all. Like no trees, no plants. Yeah. <coughs> mm -hmm. So I think um birds or or working garden could be perfect places for them to relax uh after um a day of hard work. After a day of hard work, yes. Good, very good. But the question here concerned do you need more or not? Cái câu hỏi này liên quan chuyện có cần nhiều hơn hay không nha. So you need to focus on the fact that you need more or not, I think. Yeah. Okay. So, Miss Wang, what do you think? What public places do old people usually go to and why? Uh, I think uh, in the city, cities need uh, to have more public places than towns because the Growth of populations. Uh, because so of the growth of the population. The growth of the populations. So, um, uh, we people who live in cities have uh demands to uh have more recreational uh facilities or shopping mm -hmm. mall to purchase any items and to uh working um to have a lot of uh, to have more working place and just any uh place that uh that have them to get close to the nature to, to nature. make to get to close to nature to get close to nature to uh have them more relaxed and um uh, attracted uh this uh be this kind of people mm -hmm. and uh i think that uh in terms of any towns um just um you mean chỉ cần vừa đủ những cái giải in, in any kind of town there should be just enough yes there should and be just enough but the question i'm asking you is what public places do old people usually go to and can they long go rồi oh i know it cái thứ ba cái thứ ba you're answering the wrong uh, question miss one can you try again okay try again Tonight. what public places do old people usually go to and why người già thích thường thích đi đến nơi công cộng nào và tại sao that's why uh, like, what you are answering something weird. Come on, something <laughs> weird. Something wrong. Okay, do it, please. Uh, I think that 
uh, public places the that people old people usually go is uh, the old people home and pavement cafe 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 um cafe. yeah cafe 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 or coffee shop i think uh so um most of old people uh uh, most actually, of old people or most of the old people most of the old people most of the old people. the old yeah. people uh, mm -hmm. uh actually an early early bird so uh they usually chắc chắc yeah. người lớn nào người già nào cũng uh, thích uh, dậy sớm không are you sure that yeah. most of uh, the old people are early birds are you sure <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I will be like night owls. Uh, Tôi sẽ là những con cú đêm. <laughs> <laughs> and they go to go outside and uh, go ahead to pavement cafe and to gather with another and to talk any problems in uh, their countries mm -hmm. and listen to music because uh, most of uh, the cafes in Vietnam uh, are uh, plays any music, uh, such as bolero and... Oh, terrible. Yes. <laughs> Which is kind of um, mus uh, genre music uh, in southern Vietnam. <laughs> yes. This is kind of disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <clears throat> so, anyway, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna uh, bad mouth any kind of music anymore. Tôi sẽ không nói xấu những loại nhạc khác nữa. I'm not gonna bad mouth any kind of music anymore. Okay, okay. So that's what, that's the places. Okay, very good. You see, đó rất tốt luôn á, nói rất tốt luôn á. Now, folks, try again that question. What public places do old people usually go to? Folks? Okay. Um. I think that uh, like my grandfather and grandmother usually go to the swimming pool or the Wait, study. In part three, you do not talk about personal examples, okay? Không cho ví dụ cá nhân trong part three uh, like, nhớ không? Okay, okay. Um, like, like, Let's just uh, change it to a lot of the people. Oh, a lot of the a people. Là nhiều người, a lot of the people they come to swimming pools, for example. Uh, a lot of people. A lot of the people. A lot of a lot of the people like going to the swimming pool or go into the like the stadium to like to do what? play some sport. Mm. They usually go to the park to talk with their neighbor, or uh, like do some exercise or play with their, uh, like play I with their. Issue. Okay. What else then? Mm. Okay, so do you think there will be more pub outdoor public places in the future? Why, why not? Em sẽ nghĩ, em nghĩ sẽ có nhiều nơi công cộng khác nơi trong tương lai ở ngoài trời hay không? Think about like outdoor activities, những hoạt động ngoài trời xem. Like you have concert, outdoor concerts. You have outdoor concerts. Những cái buổi hòa nhạc ngoài trời này. We have uh, uh, những hoạt động ví dụ như là thể dục thể thao ngoài trời như uh, outdoor marathon. We have a swimming pool is basically we have indoor and outdoor swimming pools. Chúng ta sẽ có hồ bơi trong nhà indoor and outdoor swimming pool. But there will be more outdoor swimming pool. What do you think? Đó nó tùy vào cái dự đoán uh, cái, trong cái cá nhân của mình và tương lai thôi là người ta sẽ thích thế nào hơn. Depending on your prediction for the future, what do you think? Do you think there will be more outdoor public places in the future? Why? Why not? Uh, I think, in my opinion, I think it will be more outdoor public place. 
uh, there will be it will be cái gì trời ơi sẽ có là there will be I think there will be more come on out of public places uh, in the future because like people like some people like to like I'm in the team who like to have parties yes uh I'm in the team you know like and then why I'm in the team and then enjoy and assimilate why about and assimilate with nature Enjoy and assimilate with nature. Hòa và thiên nhiên. Hòa lẫn với thiên nhiên. Enjoy, Enjoy and assimilate with nature. With nature. Là, assimilate có nghĩa là hòa đồng nữa nha. Assimilate also mean like you make friends and you try to be a part. Try to be a part of something. Ráng là một phần của gì đó, tức là hòa đồng. Hòa nhập. Try to assimilate with nature or enjoy nature. Okay, very good. So, Miss Yu, what do you think? Do you think there will be more outdoor public places in the future? Why, why not? Um, to be honest, I don't think so. Um, because I think that um, the facility is easier to be broken in, in outdoor due to the exposing with the sunlight. It is, uh, it is exposed daily to the element. Like, for example, wind sunlight uh, acid rain and etc nó dễ dàng bị uh, tiếp cận với những cái thành tố thiên nhiên it's easily exposed it's exposed daily to the elements like wind sunlight acid rain something like that so it's easily um, damaged right yes which made them easily to be damaged so and and currently i see more and more um indoor public places <cười> such as uh, indoor stadium indoor um a uh, concerts 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 and everything is uh, under a roof so um the, those places is uh is more convenient are are more convenient <cười> in the bath Weather in the past or in the past? Bad, bad, bad. In the weather. weather. Bad. Thời tiết tồi tệ. In the bad weather. In the bad weather. The bad weather. Weather. Yeah. So um. Although I like more, I I like outdoor public places more, but I believe that indoor public will be more popular in the future. Okay, very good. Đó là một cái trong trả lời rất là hợp lý đúng không? It's actually a very reasonable answer. Now, <coughs> let's try something else, shall we? Let's try number Who uses and use of clothes? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do unusual clothes. Những cái đồ quần áo lạ thường, unusual. So we have to distinguish between a lot of different words now. Unusual. 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 Means lạ thường. Lạ thường tức là một cái điều mà neutral. Không có, nó trung tính, không có tốt, không xấu. It's not good, not bad. Unusual. But if you use the word abnormal, abnormal là bất thường. It's a negative thing. An abnormal is a negative thing, but we have an also another word, extraordinary. 
extraordinary 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 nó sẽ mang nghĩa là phi thường phi thường là một điều tích cực very tích cực very uh, positive extraordinary không phải là extraordinary đâu như mọi người nó là mang nó là năm âm thôi there's only five syllable here extraordinary extraordinary phi thường extraordinary is a positive thing abnormal is negative unusual is negative is neutral be careful with these words okay now describe a person who you think wears unusual clothes miêu tả một cái người mà bạn nghĩ là mặc những cái quần áo lạ thường it can be a clothes that doesn't look like you should normally wear một cái loại quần áo mà bạn không nghĩ là người ta thường mặc đâu you should say Who this person is? Người này là ai vậy? How you knew this person? Làm thế nào bạn biết cái người này? What his or her clothes are like? Cái quần áo của anh ta hoặc cô ta nó nhìn như thế nào? And explain why you think the clothing is unusual. Giải thích tại sao bạn nghĩ là cái quần áo đó lạ thường thế? It can be like, for example, mặc đồ hip hop ra, mặc đồ hip hop mà nhiều ống, nhiều túi ra, ra ngoài. Uh, ra, ra ngoài đường ở Việt Nam, well actually uh, it's a bit unusual. If you wear hip hop clothes like baggy clothes, baggy clothes uh, to the street of Vietnam, it it's a bit unusual. Yes, hơi bị lạ thường. If you wear um, what's it called kimono on the, to the street of Vietnam, it's actually extremely unusual. But let's say if you wear what do you wear? mặc đồ đi biển ra ngoài đường Việt Nam thật sự rất là cực kỳ anh như rồi luôn. <cười> If you wear like bikini or swimming clothes to the on the to the street on the street, that is extremely unusual too. <cười> okay, you should say who this person is gonna be. Like, How you know this person? Là thế nào bạn đã biết người này? What his or her clothes are like? Quần áo người này mặc như thế nào? Explain why you think the clothing is unusual. Giải thích tại sao bạn nghĩ quần áo nó lạ thường you have hot three of unusual clothes. <cười> Do you think that what people wear can influence their mood? Bạn có nghĩ rằng những gì con người ta mặc có thể gây ảnh hưởng đến cái tâm trạng của họ không? Think about the color. The material. Nghĩ về cái màu sắc và chất liệu đi. Nó ảnh hưởng tâm trạng thế nào? Like uh, if the clothes If the clothes fit well or too tight, cái quần áo nó có vừa vặn với người không hay là nó quá chật? If the clothes too tight, it can make you feel extremely uncomfortable as well. Quần áo quá chật sẽ gây ra hại sức khỏe và gây ra khó chịu lắm luôn á. And it cannot affect their mood, of course. Um, ví dụ như là đang tết kỳ kinh nguyệt mà phải mặc áo dài. Girls in Vietnam, you guys know, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you are in their area, and they have to wear uh, ao yai, which is a traditional Vietnamese long dress. That is actually quite... Um, quite uncomfortable, you know. Nên mặc váy đúng không? Of course you should wear skirt, should wear skirt. <cười> But this is not something that, um, you know, I think people should stop wearing out yeah, during like, if you have your days, if you have your bad days, should not wear that, even though it's traditional. But come on, people should think about your, their health more and their comfort more. Or, um, think about the material. Some material, it's very, it makes you very um, irritated. Một số cái vật liệu quần áo có thể nó làm nó chà lên da là nhưng mà bị dị ứng hoặc là bức khó chịu. Some materials, some material, 
or fabric. Some material of fabrics can irritate the skin. Gây ra khó chịu trên mặt bề mặt da. Can irritate the skin and it's really it can ruin your mood. It can ruin their mood. Có thể làm gây hại đến tổn hại đến cái tâm trạng của một con người. Of course. Think about um, một số cái quần áo nó làm cho người ta quá quá nóng nực chẳng hạn trong thời tiết nóng bức chẳng hạn hoặc là quá ngắn trong thời tiết quá lạnh chẳng hạn. It's like some clothes, some clothes are too tight. Clothes too tight. Clothes that are too tight can can make people feel incredibly uh, uncomfortable as well. Or if it's uh, if it's too hot, hot weather, or when it's too cold and you don't wear enough, it can influence your mood as well. Hãy nghĩ về tất cả những cái trường hợp như vậy. Think about all the cases that I just talked about. You know. Do you think it's a good idea to buy clothes online? Các bạn có nghĩ đây là một ý tưởng tốt để mà mua đồ trên mạng hay không? Mua quần áo trên mạng hay không? If you have bought clothes online, you should know how to buy this. Uh, should know how to answer this question. Think about refund policy. Chính sách uh, nghĩ về nghĩ về chính sách là hoàn tiền đi. Liệu có dễ dàng không? Is it easy to have a refund? Is it easy to ask for a refund? Có dễ dàng hoàn tiền không? Is it easy to return to return the goods? Có dễ dàng để trả lại hàng không? Okay. And uh, what would happen to you if you choose the wrong size? If you happen to choose the wrong size, what would you have to do? Có rất nhiều người cứ phải đăng bài lên tôi bán tại vì tôi tại vì giày này không hợp với lại kích cỡ của tôi hoặc là tôi cảm thấy cái giày này đi không tốt chẳng hạn hoặc là quần áo mà không đúng cỡ phải bán lại chẳng hạn. There's a lot of posts daily about people buying things online and they have to resell them because the, the size doesn't fit or the, the color doesn't match what they want or maybe the material they don't like, you know. And that it's Something you have to take into consideration when you buy clothes online. Okay, when of course uh, buying clothes online, the price is cheaper. Sometimes, a lot of the time, it's cheaper. Rất nhiều trường hợp mua đồ trên mạng sang sale được rẻ hơn nhiều nha các bạn. But beware, beware of uh, bad quality clothes. Hãy cẩn thận những quần áo kích tư lượng kém Nhiều khi là hàng mà hàng xả ra, hàng bãi ấy. Mà nó gần cái, cái một cái vải muốn mục luôn rồi Thì wear bad quality clothes Like sometimes the quality of the fabric is bad For example, and they sell it for very cheap price <cười> And you cannot check because you buy things online Now, next question What kind of clothes do people wear in a workplace? Con người ta mặc cái độ gì ở nơi làm việc? And you can think about uniform, of course, but trong phục. But there's something called office style. Office style uh, dress code. You know what dress code is, right? Dress code là cái giống như là cái trang phục đó là, là phải mặc, mặc cái coat như thế nào, mặc cái uh, loại đồ như thế nào. Like for example, dress code to the party, it's formal, for example. Khi đi đến tiệc, người ta sẽ nói dress code ở bữa nay là gì, phải mặc đồ chỉnh trọng chẳng hạn. So we have something called office style dress code. We have um, casual style. Casual or formal style. Style là chỉnh trọng hay là bình thường. And think about... Um, Think about different workplaces as well. Không phải nghĩ về những cái nơi làm việc khác nhau nữa. Tại phải không phải nơi nào cũng đòi hỏi phải mặc đồ như thế. Not every places require people to wear formal clothes, you know. 
And then, what are the differences between clothes worn by old people and those by young people? Có những sự khác biệt nào giữa cái quần áo mà được mặc bởi người già và những quần áo được mặc bởi người trẻ không? Think about the fabric. The fabric. The color. Cái chất liệu vải. Cái, um, cái màu sắc. The accessory. Những cái phụ tùng trang phục. Think about the accessories. Well, ví dụ như là arm bag, like uh, thường phụ tùng trang phục nó sẽ có là cái uh, kết cườm những hạn hoặc là phụ tùng trang phục nó thường có là những cái đeo tay hay wristband, phụ tùng phục nó là cái cái vòng đeo tay này wristband, these are accessories but you need to think about uh, different age groups now cái câu này nó liên quan đến những lứa tuổi khác nhau Do you think that clothes reflect a person's point of view or opinions about many things? Bạn có nghĩ rằng quần áo nó phản ánh cái cách nhìn nhận hoặc là nhận định của con người ta về nhiều thứ không trong cuộc sống không? Think about clothes, sometimes it can reflect their political view Cách nhìn nhận chính trị Tức là họ theo cái đảng phái nào á Like what kind of political party What kind of political party That they follow What kind of um, Opinions about something Ví dụ một số người á Họ cố tình họ phải ăn mặc Phải ra ngoài phải đóng thùng Phải uh, mặc đồ tay này nọ Mà nhìn nó nghiêm túc quá Thì nó sẽ thể hiện cái tính cách của người ta Hoặc là opinion của họ là họ khá bảo thủ If you if you if you wear like um, if you wear shirts that are tucked in, bỏ vào quần, mặc những cái áo mà nó bỏ vào quần hết, shirts that are tucked in, it can uh, and then you look too you you look too formal. If you look too formal, it can indicate that you are conservative. Indicate that a person, a person can be too conservative bảo thủ quá or if if you wear clothes that are too easy for example like mặc đồ ví dụ như quần jean mà cứ cố tình để cái store mà giống như nó bị xé rách tùm lum hết á if you they wear jeans that are that are damaged in many in many Uh, spots. Những quần jean mà bị thiệt hại ở nhiều cái cái điểm này đó, the damage in many spots, it can indicate that a person is rebellious. Mang tính nổi loạn. It can indicate that a person is rebellious, for example. Or they think, uh, they think um, very freely about many issues. Is Họ nghĩ rất là tự do luôn và nhiều cái lý về nhiều cái vấn đề trong cuộc sống xã hội. Okay. Think about a lot of those things as well. Cái quần áo thật sự nó nói rất nhiều thứ nha. Clothes can actually tell a lot of things about a person you, uh, you see. Ví dụ người ta thích mặc màu, màu đen chẳng hạn. Like người thích mặc màu đen chẳng hạn. Người ta không có muốn mà quá nổi bật chẳng hạn. If people wear black, it means that they don't want to be to stand out. Black color. People do not want to stand out much. Người ta không muốn stand out, người ta không muốn nổi bật là quá nhiều. Or if people wear colorful, wear like um, colorful clothes, colorful color, it can indicate that <coughs> colorful clothes, it can indicate that they are The one in uh, they have a very open-minded open-mindedness. They have an open-mindedness. Họ có một cái sự suy nghĩ thoáng. They have an open-mindedness about many issues in life, for example. Vâng, vâng. Cái suy nghĩ đi, các bạn có phải suy nghĩ nhiều vào, xong mới trả lời mấy câu này tốt được. Think, try to think about these things. Try to create many situations as well. Okay. You have some time now. Think, please.
OK, time to talk about class. Now, Miss Yeo, please, can you describe a person who you think wear unusual clothes, please? Well, I would like to talk about um, a friend, uh, an old friend uh, who I met uh, at university, at my university. Um, uh, actually, she, she, her major is fashion design. So uh, somehow her way of wearing things is unusual compared to others. Unusual. 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 You need to be stronger. Unusual. 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 Mm -hmm. compared, to, compared to others. Um, so if you see her on the street, <laughs> you will immediately... Uh, recognize her since her colors is very colorful and and catchy. You mean her appearance? Uh, her you clothes. mean her appearance? Yeah, well. Clothes. Well, the well. appearance or the outlook, it's really colorful. Yeah. She usually, uh, she often meet and match um, the color with multiple, uh, multiple. Mitch and Mitch clothes with multiple colors and multiple colors, multiple colors, multiple, Mul UL. Mul UL multiple. Multiple, multiple colors, multiple colors, which, um, uh, it's kind of weird if, if you're not familiar with with that but if you're not familiar uh, with that it's kind of it's kind of strange or weird mm -hmm. yeah but um for me she's very creative and interesting mm -hmm. and her way and her her uh her style is 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 creative it's very creative it's quite creative okay okay good mm -hmm. okay so look for please can you describe a person who you think wears unusual clothes? Well, I think I'm going to talk about the cloud. The what? The cloud. The cow? Con bò. Cow in the, cir in the circus. Con bò trong cái no, no, no. thú hả? Chú, chú hệ. I have no idea what you mean. Ờ, ý em là chú hệ thầy. Cloud. Cloud. <cười> the cloud. Uh, the, the cloud. Clown. Clown. N đằng sau mới nhạc. The clown. The clown. The clown. Chờ em đọc là cow. Hình như ra con bò. Trời ơi. C-L. Clown. Clown. C-L. 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 Clown. Cloud. The clown. The clown. Không được. Phụ âm kép. Clown. Clown. Ok. Cố gắng phụ âm kép nhanh hơn nữa. Clown. 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 Ok. The clown in the circuit. In the circus. Uh, yeah, I know this person because last week I go to the circus and last I... Last week I went to a circus. I went to the circus and I saw the clown um like his he was his, his wear uh like he wore he what wore who, who? fake Past hair hands. he wore fake hair with a lot of colors with a lot of color and a very big like a huge shoes uh -huh. shoes uh -huh. uh, shoes and that shoe also have a lot of color and I think it's and very ridiculous. It also has a lot of color and yeah and I and uh, like yeah and I think it's very unusual clothes. Chỉ có vậy thôi sao? Is that all? Yeah. Okay, it's good enough. Short enough, but it's good enough. Đủ ngắn nhưng mà đủ tốt. Okay, next one please. When it comes to a person that uh, I think wear unusual clothes, 
I would say my best friend, who was um, who was um, who was I knew um since we were <laughs> in kindergarten. Okay. Um. <laughs> um. He usually uh wear leather clothes. And whoa, 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 what he usually wear what? Leather. Cái cái da thầy. Leather. 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 Uh, usually wear leather clothes. And I uh, with a lot of zip uh pocket. Mm -hmm. Zipper, you mean? Zipper, Zipper like yeah. Yes, with a lot of zipper, and um, I think um, this kind of uh initial clothes, because um, I think uh leather clothes is just popular in the past, um, and or any any singer, uh, in any performance or in the concerts. So you mean rock stars? Rock yes. stars are... or in any rock uh rock band mm -hmm. and I think uh his uh style uh need more time to uh needs more time to make make his outfit uh or when going outside but you mean um, it takes more time you mean it takes more time to get ready to yes. go out, right? Yes. It takes it take more, more time, time to, to get, get ready, ready to go out. It takes more time but, to get ready to go out. Yes, but his appearance uh, is so cool because they are so... They are Wait, his... it's so cool? Cool là từ lắm. <laughs> cool là từ lắm nha. Cool is a slang. His appearance is really attractive, let's just say, or good looking. Yes, he is uh, a good looking person. Uh, you a good looking guy, too. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you would say a good looking guy. <laughs> no. Uh, he's a good looking person when mm -hmm. comparing to the order. So, mm -hmm. uh, he's the, uh, the person that I want uh, that I would talk about. That's all. <laughs> Okay, good enough. Now let's go to part three now, Miss Yo, please. Do you think what people wear can influence their mood? What do you think? Yes, I do. I believe that colors and material can affect uh, people's mood. Well, um, I think the bright color can bring better mood. Better um, or better? Better. Better mood can bring better, better mood. Better mood. Mm -hmm. uh, in the other hand, the dark and gray. On the other hand. On the other hand. On the other hand, the dark or gray colors uh, can um, make a bad day worse. Well, oh, is that why I'm getting angry sometimes? <laughs> okay. Um and besides um how the how the custom fits how the clothes fits your body um body or body 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 how the clothes it, fits your body is is also have um uh it is also influence um, influence danh từ à, hoặc động từ đều như hôm đầu đó trong trường hợp này is influence it's also influence your your uh, your attitude I yes think. your attitude towards things cái thái độ của mình đối với nhiều thứ your attitude towards many things in life okay good yeah. good enough so miss yo do you think it's a good idea to buy clothes online um it depends <cười> I think if you have uh, an average uh, size and body shape, you can buy it online as long as the shop you buy is good. Okay, uh, it's a very good logic. Một cái logic rất là tốt luôn á. Because of course, normally online they sell uh, sizes, popular sizes, right? 
thường là bên ngoài thường là những cái cửa hàng online sẽ bán những cái sizes mà nó rất là thông dụng so oversized people like me I struggle to buy clothes online yes I do yeah so on the other hand if your size <cười> of body body shapes uh, are not is not common is not popular I think it's not a good idea to buy online, buy clothes online because you can um, find it very difficult, find them very difficult to fit. And besides, uh, the color and the material can be wrong mm -hmm. uh, when you received, received the, 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 the goods. When you receive the goods, I see. Okay, now, so, uh, look quickly, so what kind of clothes do people wear in the workplace? What do you think? I think they usually, like, uh, like, my, uh, I see some people, like, wear uniform, like, they wearing vest, or maybe, uh, like, a shirt with a uh, black Yes. Oh, dark pants. Yes. Go on. Go on. Uh, and like, and uh, maybe wear a shirt and a uh, blue skirt or dark shirt uh, or skirt, right? Yes, of course. Office uh, workers they wear skirt and shirts too. Nhiều người văn phòng họ mặc váy hoặc là áo sơ mi. Yes, they do. Okay, good. Uh, so, uh, do you think it's a good idea to buy clothes online? I actually I don't think so because when you buy clothes online, maybe you know, I you know the exactly size. The exact size. The exact, exact, exact size. Exact size. So the maybe exact size. Buy size maybe you will buy the wrong size mm -hmm. so i don't think by all like is good all right so let's try the next question what are the differences between clothes worn by old people and those by young people what do you think So, khác biệt giữa quần áo mặc với người già và người trẻ là gì? What do you think? I think different is like old people like wearing basics, like it's very uh, simple clothes. But young people like wearing like wearing more like they wearing like dish have colorful clothes. What's that noise? Tiếng ồn Vinh Phúc vậy? Okay, so talk please. Do you think that clothes reflect a person's point of view or opinions on many things? Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, yes, let's try this one. Go look. I think uh, it depends, but um, I tend to agree that clothes reflect a person's positive views or opinion. Uh, in terms of, uh, <laughs> it's a hard question. It's a hard because question. Yes. Think about uh, what they think of life. Think about their attitude in life. Thái độ sống. Think about... Mm. Nếu mà ta mặc đồ mà thoải mái quá, mặc đồ mà xuồng xạ thoải mái quá, thì thực tức là cái người đó rất là easy going. If people wear very casual clothes, loose clothes, những cái đồ mà nó, nó giống như bơi trong đồ luôn. Loose clothes. 
Uh, oh, it can indicate that people are very easygoing and something like that, or simple. They think simple. Or họ suy nghĩ đơn thuần đơn giản thôi. Oh, I think uh, people wear casual, um, any neutral color. Uh, uh, I usually uh, um, a person that uh, not uh, attract interest in. Uh, I mean, uh, people who are not interested in their appearance or improving in their, their appearance as much. Appearance. Uh, không, and, mà không quan tâm đến chuyện cải thiện ngoại hình họ lắm. Yes, and any people uh, usually want to expose their uh, politi- political uh, opinions, so mm-hmm. they usually uh, wear any shirts uh, that related to their uh, political party to mm-hmm. make the people. Uh, have any look uh, had any uh, positive look about their opinions and I think uh, it's a good idea to do that uh, <laughs> but, yes, uh, to do that. but on the other hand uh, some people that um, wear it um, Mặc nó quá nhiều, wear it uh, a lot. They wear too much. They wear uh, too they much. Wear, they wear too much. And I think this um, make them more low lang. <laughs> it, makes the, it makes them look, uh, how can I say, it, if, if you do overdo something, it will lead to bad results. So if you overwear something, I think, you can, you can use the word wear too much. It can make them not look as good as they should be. Or something like that. Okay, yes. it's good enough, I think. All right, good enough for today, I think. Any question? No. Okay, no. try to rewatch this video because those topics are not that easy, okay? Yes. Video này không có dễ đâu nha. Phải coi lại coi lại nha. Để sửa bài á. Okay, that's the end of my videos. Please like, share this video with your friends, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and press on the bell button next to the subscribe button so you can get notified about my new uploads, okay? You can also follow, press follow my Facebook, but please don't add me on Facebook as friends, okay? Cảm ơn các bạn đã theo dõi nha. Các bạn hãy nhấn vào like, chia sẻ video này bạn bè các bạn. Nhấn vào nút đăng ký kênh YouTube mình và nút cái chuông kế bên cạnh để đăng ký kênh đó, để mà các bạn có thể được thông báo về những video mới nha. Các bạn cũng có thể nhấn vào nút theo dõi. Facebook mình nhưng nhớ đừng kết bạn Facebook mình nha. Thank you and see you. Bye.